The LIFE Mega Project aims to reduce the concentrations of ammonia, particulate matter, greenhouse gases, and odors inside piggeries. During this virtual tour we will show you two different air treatment technologies currently installed in a pig farm in the province of Pavia, that operates under natural ventilation. By reducing the concentrations of indoor pollutants, not only a greater well-being for animals and operators is ensured, but also the emissions released into the atmosphere are lowered. Indoor air quality in the pig barn is continuously monitored by microclimate control units built by project partner NewVap. The farmer, by downloading the NewVap app to his smartphone, can monitor indoor pollutants concentrations measured in the farm in real time. Researchers of the University of Milan validated the microclimatic control units using three different instruments. The HAS dust was used to monitor dust concentration. It is a portable device that allows selective sampling of different dust fractions. The indoor ammonia concentration was measured with the Draeger XM5000, which provides its average concentration value every minute. Finally, odors were quantified by a panel of experts in the Dynamic Olfactometry Laboratory, following the N13725-2022 technical standard. The abatement technologies tested were, a dry filter and a wet acid scrubber. The dry filter consists of a series of panel filters capable of trapping particles of different sizes. This is installed in the center of the room at a height to ensure maximum filtering efficiency while avoiding contact with the animals. From the data collected in the fattening phase, we obtained a maximum abatement efficiency of 40% during the winter season, when the windows are mostly kept closed. In contrast, it was not possible to quantify relevant benefits during the summer season when the windows remain fully open to promote greater ventilation. In contrast, the system was not effective for ammonia abatement. The wet scrubber, made by partner Rota Guido, was installed outside the shed. Air, taken inside, is conveyed to the two tanks, the first containing water and the second a citric acid solution. Once treated, the air is then fed back inside the shelter. With this system we achieved a maximum ammonia abatement efficiency of 83% during the coldest months and 79% during the warmest months. Compared to the dry filter, this technology achieved a lower efficiency in dust abatement. From an animal welfare assessment perspective, researchers involved in the LIFE Mega project conducted trials designed to evaluate the potential obtainable from the adoption of the proposed technologies. Although, not many aggressive phenomena were observed within the monitored rooms, a slight decrease in the number of coughs and negative social interactions, including reduced ear biting phenomena, was noted in the treated rooms.